In nationwide civics testing, only one in four high school students reaches the level of basic proficiency. Citizenship Counts is a program designed to change that. Citizenship Counts is a national nonprofit organization whose mission is to educate middle and high school students on the basic tenets of citizenship and give them an opportunity to appreciate and celebrate their own citizenship. Civic education is on the rise across the nation. Many states require students to take the citizenship test to graduate high school. The Citizenship Counts initiative includes lessons and educational materials that meet the six proven practices in civic learning. Citizenship Counts provides students with the opportunity to engage in a lifelong learning journey which starts with our curriculum. The comprehensive program allows students to engage in activities that help them understand what it means to be a citizen, and it promotes critical thinking about the immigration process and the path to citizenship. It's education at work. It's really bringing education to life and allowing kids to see things that become three-dimensional as opposed to just reading about something in a book or seeing pictures. The program is free of charge to all educators and has been utilized in nearly 40 states throughout the country. We started partnering with Citizenship Counts the very same year that the civics requirement was part of a graduation. Since then we have had an exceptional pass rate, and a lot of that has to do with the way we engage our students through meaningful lessons ahead of time. Citizenship Counts inspires students to take pride in America and gives them a unique opportunity to participate in the democratic process while building a better understanding of the value and responsibilities of American citizenship. The program's objectives are to educate students on the tenets of citizenship, teach them to appreciate the benefits of living in our diverse and inclusive country, and provide an opportunity to celebrate citizenship and the contributions made to this country by immigrants. I think it's important for other schools to um, have ceremonies like this. Kids at this age should be able to experience how naturalization works and the amount of respect you have to put towards others and how they truly feel about this. One of the coolest things about Citizenship Counts is it was really designed for educators with student engagement in mind. The test itself is often facts, things that you could Google and things that you could study with some flashcards. What the curriculum has done is really taken those things and instead of just learning the things, you're learning about the stories and engaging and applying those opportunities through student-to-student -student discourse, teacher opportunities, and they can actually research and be part of that process. A lot of times that then makes the test more meaningful because of the connections behind it. And Citizenship Counts really did that in an intentional way that then provides students with the opportunity to walk away and start those conversations the very next day. Citizenship Counts was founded in 2008 by author, humanitarian, Holocaust survivor, and proud naturalized citizen, Gerda Weissman Klein, as her way of giving back to her adopted country. I love this country with a love that only one who has been homeless and hungry can understand. Gerda's love for the United States inspired her to create Citizenship Counts. Students have the unique opportunity to participate in an authentic naturalization ceremony where people are actually sworn in as U.S. citizens. I'm looking at you, my new fellow citizens, because you my own moment when I swore this oath, a sacred oath, a holy one. We had students singing, we had students saying poems, we had students doing readings. All of them together and then singing at the end was a day I will never forget. It was probably one of the greatest days of my career as an educator. Watching individuals who have worked really, really hard for something actually come and take an oath knowing that this is part of a larger journey through a process that may have taken any number of pathways and really allowing them to be part of watching somebody celebrate a new citizenship moment is kind of unbelievable. And as you become citizens, understand that citizenship is a verb. It's not a noun. It's active. It's not passive. It is a way of life. Both local and national communities recognize the positive effect the program has on citizens across the country. 
It made me feel proud to be an American. It's a feeling when you're sitting there and you, you know, you watch all the families come together and stuff. It's just you have to be there to experience all that. Teachers and curriculum specialists nationwide have utilized citizenship counts to meet the increasing mandates in civic education. They not only got to connect to the process, having learned about it prior to, but they also got to see the families that were here, the impact that they knew it would have, and then the guest speakers who took that impact and kind of hit it home with the awakening that, wow, these people really are citizens now. All the people just were so happy, and I just saw a look on their face like, okay, we're Americans now, and this is our responsibility to just unite as brothers and sisters and just care about our country and everything. To see 20 different people from 20 different countries embrace what it means to be an American, I think that's something that will stay with them forever. And I think every school should be clamoring to have the opportunity to host a naturalization ceremony. It's an honor, it's a blessing, it's a great opportunity to be here today and to have finally become a citizen of the United States. That's awesome. I'm really happy today. <laughs> very, very happy. The citizenship ceremony was really important to me because my dad, he's originally from Syria and he was naturalized like a couple years back and it was very nice seeing these 20 uh, newly U.S. citizens um, become naturalized today. It was just amazing. This is the real stuff. These are the things that inspire and provide opportunities for kids to, to do great things in life. And having exposure to this citizenship opportunity is one great example of that. To learn more about Citizenship Counts, please visit us on our website at citizenshipcounts.org.